And right now, KCRA 3 is teaming up with Vitalit for the annual Blood Drive for Life. This year's event will put vital will provide vital supplies. Thousands of blood drives across the country have been canceled because of the COVID pandemic. And the community was so eager to donate this time around that all of our appointments have already been taken. Still, though, there is an opportunity to give. Yes, KCRA 3's Brittany Johnson joins us live from outside the Sacramento Central YMCA. Brittany? That's right. You see, I'm inside the gym here and it's empty, but we did see a steady stream of people here tonight. It's empty because it's a wrap out here tonight, but we saw the daily total today, 186 people coming out to participate, 381 people for both locations in the two days. Each person showing up has a different reason and a different story as to why they came out to donate. Bonnie D. Benedetto knows all too well how a few minutes out of her day can go a long way. At just two days old, her baby boy needed an exchange transfusion to save his life. It was terrible. I was just so afraid and he was so tiny, you know. I mean, he was a big baby, but he was a tiny little thing. Um, and the doctor suggested that the only way he could, you know, get back to healthy was to have an exchange transfusion, which is where they, they actually take all the blood out and put replace it with new blood. Bonnie started donating shortly after. Her son signed up as soon as he became eligible. He was like 17, I think you had to have a parent sign. They had a blood drive at his high school. And he knew the story about what happened after he was born. And he just signed right up. And he's been doing it ever since. For others, they simply saw the need and have been looking for ways to give back to the community during the COVID-19 pandemic. I feel like being stuck at home for so long, there's only so much that you can do. Um, so I do feel, I, I feel like this, this effort is very important for the community. Last year was bad for me. Last year was really bad. I had a lot, a lot of deaths, family, friends, and so I just wanted to give back. Every two seconds, someone needs blood. A need to Cara Coates, a nurse with Vitalant, says extends beyond the COVID-19 pandemic. Even though we're facing a pandemic at this time, patients are coming in, trauma patients, patients that are uh, receiving chemotherapy, definitely still need um, whole blood. So still running these blood drives is very essential. If they're healthy enough to get out here and to do it, then just do it. For a donation center near you, just go to vitalent.org. We also have a link to that website on our website, kcra.com. Now reporting live tonight in Sacramento, I'm Brittany Johnson, KCRA 3 News.